So hello and welcome to a very special edition of Airfield Mixologist and today I'm gonna fire up the Lister D for the first time in god knows how many years. So I've done all the pre-fired checks, so oiled everything, the fuel, the fuel doesn't, uh, does, there are no fuel leaks, I checked that the fuel comes to the carb, uh, put the needle and I kind of grease the oilers so and obviously put oil inside the engine as you do um, so everything seems to be uh, in order to commence the the, the the to just fire the engine up for the first time and, and I haven't fired it so this is going to be a true you know first start in I don't know how many years this is going to be a much of a surprise for you as it's going to be to me so let's hope this is going to work so I'll, I'll fire it up in an hour. So, technically, yeah, it should just go. It should just go. Oh. Oh, I couldn't. It's go.
Okay, so that worked um, okay. I mean, there is, there are a few problems with the engine. It's, it needs a bit of fettling, really, and, and just going through a few bits and bobs. It's quite jumpy. That probably requires a bit of timing adjustment and and play around with the carb settings and everything else. But <clears throat> there are lots of positives. So the engine fired up. I fired it on and off, on and off, on and off several times, and each time it just it just went. Uh, so so that's really good. Uh, and 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 again, I think it's it's just a question of adjusting a bit the the timing so that it's um so so that it's uh, i think it's got too much advance but i can i can i can sort that out r relatively quickly and just playing around with the settings a bit to find uh, a place where the engine is happy but but the other positive is that there were no obvious like knocks or anything the engine isn't smoky uh, it, it has good compression so actually I think we are we're on to a bit of a winner with this one uh, obviously thank you very much for watching thank you very much if you've been following the series especially Mr. KT uh, who always leaves some comments so thank you very much mate for following this up and so now what I'm going to do now I'm, I'm gonna in the next video I'm gonna see if I can if I can get the engine to run just a touch better uh, in terms of all the all the bits and bobs that that could be improved, uh, and then I need to start building up the rig completely. So putting the compressor back on and, and trying trying to get the compressor to run again and all that stuff. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. See you in the next episode.